is not predicated on who else is here. Amen. <laughs> it's what God has given us as each individual to be, few, to be truthful to himself, to express himself in doing the will of God. Yes. Because if we are, we, we put God first. Yes. Yeah, that's a funny thing. I'm going to say this. When we, when, we, when we were working, or when we are going to work, we are what? On time. On time. On time. Yeah. Don't miss a day. Huh? On time. Uh -huh. yeah. Making sure that we get there on time. Yes. Yeah. But when it comes to serving the Lord, it's whenever we get there, you know? That's not all of us, but I'm just speaking. So many of us do not give God the proper time that he deserves. Because he's a good God. He's an awesome God. And, he's, and we deserve to, 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 uh, to do his will and, and to do all that we can, and that including being on time. Yeah. Am I right? Amen, amen. Uh, repeat after me. Make a joyful noise unto the Lord all ye land. Make a joyful noise unto the Lord all ye land. Serve the Lord with gladness. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with singing. Come before his presence with singing. As we come before his presence with singing. Behold, the hour cometh, ye is now come, that ye shall be scattered, every man to his own, and shall leave me alone. And yet I am not alone, because the Father is with me. These, These things I have spoken, have spoken unto you, that in me ye might have peace. peace. In, in the world ye shall have tribulations, but be of good cheer. I have overcome the world. The world. Peace I leave with you, my peace is given unto you, not as the world giveth. Give I unto you, let not your hearts be troubled, neither let it be afraid. For, for we are our peace, who have made one, and have broken down the middle of the law of petition between us. Having abolished in his flesh the enmity, even the law of commandments contained an ordinance for to make in himself a twine, one new man, so making peace. And that he might reconcile both unto God, one and one another, by the cross, and the enmity And came and preached peace to you which were afar off and to them that were nigh. And the peace of God, which passeth all understanding, 
shall keep your hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. Finally, brethren, whosoever, whatsoever thing are true, whatsoever things are honest, whatsoever things are just, whatsoever things are pure, whatsoever things are lovely, whatsoever things are of good report, if there be any virtue, and if there be any praise, think on these things. Altogether, those things which ye have both learned, and received, and heard, and seen in him, do, and our peace shall be with you. Let us bow our heads in prayer. Heavenly Father, we come before thanking and praising you because you've been yeah. so good to us. Yeah. You have blessed us and you've kept us. And we say thank you, Lord. Thank you, you have allowed us to come out once again to lift up that holy and precious name. Not because that we were so wonderful and we were so good that, 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 that you didn't have a choice, but you did have a choice. And we're not that good. We're not that wonderful. Yes. We, you are, and you alone, and we praise you for touching us with that thing of yes. and letting us come out. Let us have, let us have a hope, open minds and open hearts that we might be able to receive the word that we have come together this day to lift up that holy and precious name. Let us be edified in that word. Let us show joy and love not only here but when we leave this place, because we pray that you continue to bless and keep us in all our ways. In Jesus' name. We Amen. Amen. Our sanctuary. stand for our opening hymn this morning.
on our program thing, working on the building. We thank all who prepared the delicious dinner for the sweet service. Happy birthdays to our January board members, Deacon Anthony Harris, 13th Minister, Robert Campbell, the 14th, Deaconess Bertha Kara White, 15th, and Deaconess Dan Green, the 22nd. Weekly reminders, see the back of your program, Meet Up Right Church every Sunday. Call Deaconess Birch or 301 735 3475 to make some operations. Uh, please pray for the whole Dick Gumbert um, Ben Barr family Jenkins, Smalls, Valentine, Joyner, Lester, Smith, Austin, Sheldon. Harrison Thought of the week. When America was founded, the founding fathers created governor frameworks based on biblical principles. The word of God was to be compass that keep us headed in the right direction. However, over time we have slowly changed from one nation under God to a group of people unsure if they want God to continue to be allowed to be fully involved. For this reason, in many ways, we have become ungodly nation. When many of our people have fallen captive to false idols, and materialism, and mass power, martyrally, and rebellion and empty philosophies, and false decorum, doctrines, which are widely acceptable based upon the word of God, but unfortunately, we have been too often voted to get to take God out of nation. Official business we have often forgotten God we trust. Yet even when the mindset of confusing messaging all around and I believe in society, people can in the choose to follow God. The word of the word will contain decimate faulty teaching so believers must be desecrated. Otherwise ignorant messages can lead us to Compromise our convictions without God's guidance, our minds become vulnerable to lies and world expectations. So, as believers, we must be discerning of God's word, the compass which keep us headed in the right direction. However, I will be desperate. We pray to God for His blessings, desperate. We need to constantly to be filled with truth and reading, reading believing in meditation upon find His scriptures. This is why we are told in Mark Thesis 517 to pray pray with us even when our minds stay focused on him. Unholy beliefs will not be able to take root. God's truth, God's truth will be confronted and holy boldness and his spirit will that, that, mm, direct strengthen us that we may live victorious in lives in him. Visit and support our church uh, website at mjbcmd.org at Twitter and Neutralism, BC, Google, Google Plus, Yahoo, YouTube, YouTube, Facebook, be sure to visit sign and direct others to the site in May. Thank you. someone that has been on my mind for, for days, for months, maybe for a year or more. And I'm blessed to see her in the house this, this morning. So that's a good thing. That's a good thing. And uh, I thank the young daddy. My had something to do with it. Thank you. here also to lift up one another. Because if you can't lift up one another, there's no sense in lifting up Jesus. You know what I tell you? Because it's not about us. It's about him and about you. 
when I say about you, I mean me to you and you to me. That makes a difference. We just thank God. This is our fourth Sunday, and uh, we have uh, uh, our pastor is away. He suddenly he had to go. He's in uh, uh, Georgia, Augusta, Georgia. Maybe he's on the way back now. He said he'll be coming back today. So, and he drove, so I, I imagine that he's on the road. So we want to keep him in prayer for, for traveling grace, you know what I mean? Because traveling on the highway doesn't mean that the things happen that, that you have no control over. But that's like any place else we go. We have no control. So we are dependent on God to direct us and guide us as we go down the way, as we travel the highways and the byways. Uh, this is our uh, fourth Sunday. We also recognize uh, uh, this is a birthday on the fourth Sunday. And I don't mind telling you that I just had a birthday. Good God. I feel so good. Amen. We had a few birthdays here. Uh, all the birthday people stand. Let them just stand. All the birthday. I'm already standing. Amen. 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 Yeah. I see Sister Green, Green name on and she's not here today. But Lisa, her birthday is today. Her birthday is today. Her birthday is today. So the 22nd. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. It is the 22nd. It's supposed to be a surprise. So when you come in, don't tell her that it's a prize we'll be working for. Okay? Okay, then we just thank you. Have we got uh, the lady standing? Is a sister of uh, White. And she had a birthday on the 15th. And I so wanted to have you. How, how are you doing today? I'm doing great, thank you. That's right, on the 15th. You, know, you don't normally ask ladies how old they are. Normally. Normal. That's what I said normal. But, but since her and I are so close, I think I can ask her. Okay. I'm 69. Great day. Oh, Amen. 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 And uh, how old you? 57. Great man. 69, 57. And my birthday was on the 14. Look at that. 12, 13, 14. And somebody asked me. 12, 13, 13, 13, no, 13, 14, 15. No, I'm getting some. You know what I mean? My, I had one too. And since I'm older for the crowd, I don't have to tell. Oh, <laughs> I thank God. She's trying to make me tell. Uh -huh. Yes. How old are you, Pastor Kim? I know you don't mind telling your age. I'm 79. 79. 79. 79. <laughs> Amen. Amen. I'm thinking that just quickly, for those to the standing, the younger ones, say happy birthday to them. Let us. Amen. Happy birthday to Would you mind telling us your name and what church you're a member of? Okay, I'm Sharika Lee. Okay. Sharika Lee. Yes. 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 Y
Um, my name is Shane Davis. I'm a member of Pilgrim Rest Baptist Church, and I'm here visiting with my brother. Your brother? Yeah. Well, they be showing up every day. <laughs> and this Pilgrim yeah. Rest right there on the street. Yes. Yeah, it's happy to see you. Happy to He brought you in. Yes. Amen. He's working. He's working on the building. Amen. We just thank to have you. Come visit us at any time. We're so happy to have you. If you're part of Daniel, you're part of us. Amen. If you wasn't part of Daniel, you'd still be part of us. Amen. But you're more part of us now that because you're part of that, all that will bless it up. All will bless it up. Then we leave it alone. And we're so happy to see uh, all of you coming in. Everybody's here this morning. Uh, now we go back <coughs> to uh, uh, Minister of Music. We follow the Minister of Music. We're going to have our offering. Amen. Amen. Oh, I meant to tell you, I meant to say this though. Today is uh, the fourth Sunday, and we go to uh, 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 Deanwood, where we go to render service to the people that are shut in. We go there because they're shut in, but they're not what? Shut, shut, out. shut out. So we go in there to render service to them that uh, uh, so that we can be a blessing to them. But I can tell you when you go. That blessing change, 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 change situation. We are blessed. Yes, ma'am. She said she would like to sing a song for the church. Oh, no, she did. Yes, she did. Oh, yes, she did. Yes, she did. Yes, she did. Yes, she did. Amen. Oh, Lord have mercy. I feel so good right now. She said that. Uh, after the collection come, after our offering come, I'm looking forward for you to sing because I'm off. I'm excited already. I'm already excited. We thank you to come after we have our offering. Amen. Oh, we don't have a selection. No, no, no. She don't sing after. She's going to sing after the offering. Amen. <laughs> 